Welcome back guys. I hope all of you will be fine. So this is question 2.34 and the statement here is that how many distinct permutations can be made from the letters of the word columns. Okay. Uh, so this is another very interesting question and let me solve it. Okay. So solution of it is here. So now uh, in order to solve it, let me utilize this same position which we have been following in all of these questions and that is basically the box or the slot supposition. Okay. So uh, let me first count that how many um, alphabets or letters we have here. So these are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So I have 7 letters here and uh, in 7 letters let me have a box here in which I will have how many possible ways okay so these are four five six and this is seven one two three four five six seven so these are the seven slots and uh, here in first slot how many options would i have here so i will have here out of these sevens uh, i may have any letter here so uh, the number of possible ways here are seven or let me write it here Similarly, in this in this spot, how many options would I have here? So, after this seven, how many uh, letters are left which has to be placed here? So, I will have six letters which has to be placed here. Okay. So then, after it, if two uh, letters are placed here, this can be cannot be replicated because I have seven spots here, and in these seven spots, I have to write the numbers out of them. So here now again, I will have five then four then three then two then one okay so what is this this is basically the seven factorial okay so um, in seven factorial ways or seven factorial are the different permutations or different uh, words which can be made of all the letters which are mentioned here and these are c o l u m n s so uh, this is what the answer of it is what seven factorial similarly in solving part b here what is this how many ways of these permutations start with the letter m okay uh, so we have here again these seven letters and we have to find the ways that how many words can be made out of these letters in such a way that the first part has been uh, captured by the letter m okay so when this m has been replaced here so i will know that here at first part i will have which letter here i will have m okay so let me have here m okay so if m is available here that's what i know now and therefore in order to put other numbers in these places what i will have here here i will have six options okay here i will uh, have five here four here three here two and here one and these have to be multiplied together so therefore here i will have how many um, permutations here i will have Six factor because the first location is now captured and this is what i know uh, i have to make changes in the other locations or other spots which are here so therefore these are six factorial and this is what the answer of part b okay uh, so i hope you have understood the underlying concept of this question uh, which is basically the sampling without replacement okay uh, so you can see that once i have put it some number here it cannot be replicated at the other spots similarly when another letter has been placed here it cannot be replicated in the other positions or in other spots as well similarly if third is placed here it cannot be replicated and so on because this is now what this is the sampling without replacement okay because these words or these letters cannot be replaced uh, again once these are put it in one location or in one spot so i hope uh, the concept is now clear and i will see you with some more stuff in our upcoming video see you soon